Hey guys, it's Trippy Pepper here, and today we're going to play some random trio Mar pit. So I know I said I'd do a live stream today. That's not happening. It's probably going to be tomorrow, um, but I I'm not quite sure. Uh, I mean, it's the holiday for me, so I can do live streams whenever, really. Um, oh, wait, what? Oh, he's in the Curly Gamer. Oh, I thought he was actually Curly Gamer. Sweet. Okay. So this is a pretty good loadout for random trio. I'm, I'm really liking this loadout, attack shooter, bomb, farm, I didn't actually see his record, it was too quick, so he could be like terrible or it could be amazing, I have no idea, so, and you can't even tell because you don't know what strategy he would have gone with, so let's just think he's pretty good because, I mean he's in Curly Gamers Clan so he must be grinding, I guess, so we're going to go for the farm start, um, we're going to get the more bananas straight off, and then we're going to go for the blade shooter. Uh, put it in the corner here, so most, or at least most, of the attacks hit the track. So, um, before I start, like, uh, the proper commentary, uh, join my Discord server. It's really, really good. Um, we've got, like, 80 people in it now. Well, a crazy amount of people. Thank you so much, guys, um, for being in it. And it's just really nice chatting to you guys. So, yeah, join my Discord server. Follow me on Twitter. Uh, links in the description, as always. Right, so he still hasn't got um, the blade shooter yet. He, oh, he's going for the tax sprayer. I wouldn't have gone for the tax sprayer because it's got less popping power. Because if you think about it, it shoots out... How many does it shoot out? This shoots out... Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. shoots out 8. So the tax sprayer shoots out 16. But... The blade shooter has three pierce on each of the ones, so technically the blade shooter actually has more popping power. So yeah, definitely the blade, um, definitely the blade shooter is the best not uh, the best option to go. Right, let's get another farm up to more bananas, or should we get our banana plant? No, we're gonna go for the extra farm, then get our banana plantation. He still has an upgrade. He's getting a he's getting a cannon. Oh my god, he's wasting his money over there. And he's got the tax rail, which again isn't as good as the blade shooter. You can see my blade shooter is dealing with everything at the moment. We're gonna send a few couple of blacks just to get past that cannon. And then the tax uh, hopefully we can like leak maybe 20 lives off him. Not quite yeah, it looks like we're gonna get some lives off him. Sweet. Okay. And he, he's actually sold his bomb tower to get another tax shooter. Let's hope he gets this one up to No, he's getting another tax spray. He is Okay. Right, he is not being smart here. It's honestly not the best thing to do to go with that. We've also got the bomb tower. I'll put it here. I think this is a good spot for it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a good spot for it. Set that to close. Right, so if he sends me yellows, I could sell the farm. No, but I'll have enough money anyway. So I'll just sell this. Uh, get the cluster bombs up. Deal with everything fine. Doesn't look like he's rushing me. He's actually buying another farm, which means we can get another farm as well. And even if he does sell, uh, send yellows, we can still defend it with this defense. It's much better than his defense at the moment. He's got two tax sprays up, so that's really not a lot of popping power. So there's like no, there's no camo defense whatsoever. I've just realised. So we're going to sell everything and go for an all-out camo rush really soon. We'll have to, uh, we have to do it really, really quickly. Send camo pinks. That will kill him pretty easily. Right. So. Also, oh no, we have less lives than him. Why don't we send two leads? And then we'll boost the camo pinks on the next round. We'll see if we can do some damage to him. We're both going to be doing it. So it won't really make much difference. Oh, and he's getting he's getting the ring of fire up. Nice. Right, so I'm just going to boost that. Boost camo pinks to him. He is doomed. He is doomed. There's no way he's defending that. <laughs> he goes to the Blade Maelstrom. That is not going to defend the camos, and we win the first game. Nice. Whoa, his record's really good. Whoa. I'm just going to say sorry, and we're going to do another game. Right, so he's actually in the Curly Gamer clan. Curly Gamer's a, a really good YouTuber. You should definitely check him out. Did two collabs with him recently, which was nice. Probably post those soon. Right, so let's see if we get a, another good opponent for this one. Right, I was also thinking of doing some Bloons Monkey City uploads, or even Bloons TD5 uploads, and especially Bloons TD6 when it comes out, because I really like those games, and I feel like if you're just uploading battles every day, 
well in my opinion it gets a bit boring that's just my opinion tell me what you guys think I'll probably put a poll I normally forget to do the polls though so if I forget to do that then I'm sorry this is taking ages oh okay good so Reb and Vodka nice I hope this is um I played a Reb guy apparently he didn't get his badge uh, for coming um first in the world maybe third I can't exactly remember right this is a good loadout we're gonna go with this so we'll start off with the Cobra we're gonna start off with the Cobra then we're gonna get the um, heli pilot up because he's going to send us um, continuous reds which the Cobra can't handle surprisingly enough the Cobra is really good against fast balloons like the blacks the pinks etc they send like a rod and you've got tons of Cobras up. It actually deals with it fairly well if you have like a bomb tower as well, which is surprising. So I know not many people use the Cobra anymore because it's hated so much, but that's definitely a thing you can do. So we're gonna send a couple of Reds at him, but we're gonna save enough money so we can buy the Heli Pilot exactly the same time as him. And we're gonna lock in place. Oh, I like this new feature that you can like choose where to lock in place before but before you couldn't choose so if you had to do, you had to do follow mouse and then click uh, lock in place but I, I, I like this so you lock in place you set where you want it to be locked nice that's a pretty good update actually I hope the balance changes coming up in 4 point whatever is good I really hope it's good because if it's not then I'm honestly just going to die it's getting so boring we need the chip back the chip was so good so he's getting the quad darts I'm gonna get another. Should I get the? Should I get the quad dart? I'm gonna get the quad darts. Nice. That's a lot of popping power right there. But if you look how much it sells for, it it probably costs me like two thousand, which is insane for like the amount of popping power. Because as you saw, a blade shooter could deal with um, r even greens just fine, whereas the heli pilot wouldn't deal with greens fine, and it is so much more expensive. So you can see they have like a few balance changes to do. I feel that the buff they did to the tax shooter was very, very good, as the tax shooter is so much better now. So there's going to be greens coming out now. Um, I think we'll be okay. We might have to buy another heli pilot, but in that case, he'll have to buy another one as well. I think we'll find until yellows, in which case we have to get another quad darts up. I reckon he's going to rod me, uh, regen rainbow rush me, honestly, because that's probably the smartest thing to do. Although I think I think I could defend it if I got enough money up. So he's stopping sending Eco to get up that next heli pilot. He's also layering the balloons, I think. He's gonna send Oh no, okay, he's just sending a few reds. Okay, that's good for us to get. I thought he was going to um layer reds, then blues, then greens, and then finally yellows uh, to try and uh, cause some more damage. Right, okay. So he sends yellow. He's actually getting some more cobras up. I'm gonna go for a small yellow rush. See if we can force him to build anything. Oh, and we force him to build another heli pilot. Cool. Okay. And he he got out to quad darts as well. Wow. Right. So that's good for us, I guess. He's also getting more cobras up, which are gonna come very useful. Maybe we'll go for the rush. We'll try to go for the rush around early. Maybe. I'm I'm not quite sure. So we're going to lock this in. We're going to lock this in place right here and get Razor Rotors on it as well. And then, um, come on, come on, Razor Rotors. Oh, I got the wrong side. I got the wrong side. Come on, Razor Rotors, do your stuff. It's actually pretty good, the Razor. Oh, no. Oh, it's on Pursuit. Oh, my God. This, oh. Are you kidding me? It was on... Oh. Whatever. Let's get another one. This one is set to pursue. Right, so we're actually going to go for a small zebra rush against him. And we'll send yellows... <laughs> that failed. <laughs> that really failed. Wow. He popped that so quickly. Right. Okay. So, we need to get another heli pilot up. He's spamming those cobras like crazy. Maybe that's what we should be doing. I'm not sure. Maybe that was the wise thing to do. We definitely have more eco than him. We probably have like a hundred more, I think. Which is very nice indeed. Uh, I reckon he's going to send regen... Um, I reckon he's going to send regen leads. But we'll see. We'll see. 
I'm I'm not gonna say anything. I think he's got a good enough defense to defend whatever I send at him at the moment. These Cobras will deal with the ceramics very well, unless they're camo ceramics, of course, in which case the heli pilots will deal with that, I think. I think the heli pilots are good enough to deal with it. Right, so his snipers are doing work, and he's starting to balloon adjust me. Hmm, what should we do? He's starting to balloon adjust me. I think we're going to have to get um, that up. Get that up as well. I'm pretty sure that that can deal with... Um, pretty sure it can deal with the Moab, our defense at the moment. But I, I'm going to send a Moab to him, just to see what happens. Uh, this balloon adjustment is getting... Oh my god, it's getting strong. So we are going to have to get... We're going to have to get our assault rifle uh, up really quickly. We're also going to have to, um, oh, we're going to have to boost that. We're going to have to boost. We're going to have to get this up as quick as possible. Is he going to die to the Moab? Oh, he didn't even leak any lives. It looked like he would have died. Oh, my God. Okay, so let's get this assault rifle up. Come on, come on, come on. Give me the money. Nice. So this will deal with everything pretty well. Uh, we need to get this... Um, Whatever it's called, I think it's called like point five zero. It doesn't give you any of the names of the update uh, of the upgrades. Which oh no, he is going all out, guys. He is going all out. He is going all out with this. We are doomed. We cannot defend this at all. We're just going to be overwhelmed by everything. That that's rip. Gg. He actually got the offensive push up. So I'm, I'm just going to say well done. <laughs> okay. Well, that's the end of that game. Also, um, do you guys like longer uploads or shorter ones? Because I'm thinking of making everything about 15 minutes long. Maybe longer. I'm not sure. Whatever you guys want. So, let's see if we get another good opponent. Oh, the unknown. Does that say God? I can't even see with uh, my video timer in the way. Let's see. The unknown God. Right. So, he's got a 2,000... 25,000 prestige. Oh, God. He's also in Curly Gamer YT's hand. Wow. <laughs> so lots of uh, lots of grinders. Okay, uh, we're not gonna. Yeah, we are actually. It's got the Dartland gun. That's decent. We have enough money to get. Oh come on, that was gonna be a really good one. I would have gone with the like laser cannon and stuff. So interesting. I'm gonna skip it because he likes that one. I'm just gonna try and be annoying because he really. Oh, Battle River. Because he really annoyed me. Battle River is really good. Okay, sweet. So we've got the. I swear we got the sniper in like every loadout so far. And it's a terrible tower. It really, really needs a buff badly. So we're going to put our boomerang here. And we're going to get it to Bionic Boomer as soon as we can. Of course, we will be sending, um, we will be sending, uh, Eco. Like Eco Reds, Continuous Reds. It doesn't look like he's upgraded his boomer at all, which is interesting. Not quite sure why. Uh, we're actually going to go for the that straight off. Oh, he's got an interesting decal. I'm not sure what it is. I can't really see. But it looks pretty cool and sparkly and stuff. So he's doing the same as me. He's getting that up. To be honest, it's a really good spot for the boomer. It, it has like this bend down here on the left side bottom. Then it has this one that it's shooting at right now. And they're both really good. Although it looks like he's getting more overwhelmed than me. Oh, I am starting to get overwhelmed now. So I have to be careful to only eco to that. So we can get our Barnic Boomer up. Nice. So we haven't leaked any lives. We haven't used any spikes. So we are doing better than him at the moment. In my opinion. He's got his Barnic Boomer up as well. We're equal on eco. The problem with this will be the camo balloons. I'm going to have to get a Glaive Lord up, which is a shame. Probably put it in the bottom left, like below my um, Boomerang here. So, uh, he's sending, um, pinks to me. It's not going to do anything. I'm not going to send pinks to him because it won't get past his boomer, as he just saw. So, he's losing out on eco there, and I'm gaining it faster than him. So, I'm probably about 20 ahead of him at the moment, which is nice. It's not it's not a big bonus, but it is a, it's a kind of small bonus, and every, every little helps, doesn't it? <laughs> so, it's going to go on to green eco in a minute. Uh, the boomer can handle that easily, really easily. Also, it's blacks as well. But again, the boomer can handle that. The problem will start to occur when it's like regrow whites. They could sneak through fairly easily. Right, so 
four, we got 437 eco on round six. I'm quite happy with that. We're kind of both anti-stalling a little bit, but not too much though. And it's kind of fine because we're both in the same boat with the same towers, same everything really. So the balloon chip will be very useful for those ceramics, which would be problematic. Uh, Glaive Lord for the camos, obviously. I don't want to micro the boomer ability because first thing my micro is not very good. Secondly, we can run out of money. He's still going with the eco. I'm probably going to go to 600. I think 600 is a good amount. And you can see the hooking action of the boomer is insane. It's just clearing up everything. Really good. So we're going to get to 600. Come on. I'm not sure if he's going to go above 600. Come on. Good. Okay, I'm going to stop now. I'm going to stop now. I'm going to save up for my next boomer. Interesting that he's... Oh, he stopped as well. Okay. He stopped as well. We're going to put our... Where should we put our boomer? Our glaive lord should... I think we're going to put our glaive lord here. He's still going with the pinks. He's going to have a trouble... He's going to have trouble against the, um, the camo balloons. He is really going to have trouble against them. Send a few of those. They'll get past, hopefully. As I said, um, the boom is not great against these regrows. Although the hooking action is really good. But it looks like he's getting overwhelmed. He is getting overwhelmed. I'm going to send out some regen rainbows. Is he going to die? Uh, do we have enough money? Oh, do we have enough money for the um, Glaive Lord? Oh, this is going to be close. Yes, we do. Or do we? No, we don't. We need one more eco thing. We're going to see if he sends some camo balloons at me. He sends clam camo balloons at me. I am sorted. So we're going to go for that Glaive Lord. We're going to go for that Glaive Lord. Send a few camo zebras so he has to use that ability. He's going to have to use that ability. Is he not going to use the ability? Oh, and it's picking off the greens instead of the pinks. And the pinks are going to walk right past. Oh. And we don't have any, any camo ceramic popping power. So we're gonna we're gonna get this up, set to strong, and we'll have to set, sell the Glaive Lord. We're gonna have to sell the Glaive Lord if he sends camo ceramics. Oh no, we have red spikes though. We do have red spikes. Right, we're gonna send that. Just gonna send that. Hopefully that uh, the camo. Oh, and he uses the he uses the boomer ability. Nice. So already getting him to uh, use that. Nice. Okay. So we've got the Glaive Lord up. That will deal with most things apart from uh, ceramics. So we might have to get that. We're going to get that Bionic Boomer up now. That's a good place. Ooh, I kind of used up a good place uh, for that. But no worries. So we're just going to do a few more of those. And he gets the Glaive Lord up in time. So I'm just going to say nice, because that that was well done. GG. So, he's sending some more pinks at me. I'm not sure why. I'm going to send a Moab. I'm going to send a Moab. Hopefully, it will get past his defense. Um, he, he has the Glaive Lord and the Boomer. If he uses the Boomer ability, he might defend, to be honest. But I'm, I'm not sure. If he sends one at me at the moment. I'll be able to defend it with my Boomer uh, ability. So he's using the Boomer ability. It looks like he's going to defend this with ease. And we're going to get our Bionic Boomer up. Right, so we can sell the Balloon Chipper to get the ability. We've got the Glaive Lord. We are, we are pretty much sorted. We've got a decent eco. His eco is probably a little higher than mine. He sends a BFB. He sends a BFB. I'm not sure what to do. I'll just have to like spam as many of the abilities as possible. So I, I, I reckon he's going to send one to me. So I'm just going to wait and try and defend it. He could send a uh, fast cooldown. He could send fast cooldown uh, Moabs. I, I can't see him doing that though. So hopefully he's not doing that. Right, so it looks like he's sending a BFB. He is sending a BFB. We're going to road spike it. Because that will actually help it a lot. So he's actually boosting pinks behind it. Interesting. So we're going to get ready for this defense. We are going to get ready for this defense. We will defend it. We will defend it. How many How many should we get? I think three can defend, to be honest. I think three can defend. With the boost, obviously. Come on. 
Right. Come on. Defend this for me. Come on, monkeys. You can do it. Yes. It looks like we're going to defend. It looks like we're going to... And we defend the beer. Oh, yes. And we defend it. We defend it. Nice. Okay. So, we are sorted for the moment. Defended that BFB pretty easily. He got his eco back, though, fairly quickly. Which is okay, I guess. So, we're not... We're just going to get our eco up now. We're just going to concentrate on getting, hopefully, a thousand eco. Hopefully, a thousand. Sounds like a lot, but it honestly isn't much for round 24. And if, if he sends... As, oh my god. Well, it's too slow. If he sends fast cooldown BFBs... Then I think I can defend it. I'm pretty sure I can defend it with lots of boomerangs. I've got my boost back. We've got three bloom boosts uh, for him in case we want to send a rush. So I think we'll be okay. And we got, of course, we got our glaive lord, which can clear up everything else. So he's basically got the same defense as me, apart from he's got the sniper. I just don't find the sniper helpful in situations like this. It's not really doing anything for him whatsoever. He should probably sell it and just get another Bionic Boomer up. But I guess he can do what he wants. So it's round 23. Uh, we can send out a Zomai... Oh, we can already sound it. We can send out fast cooldowns, oh my god. So I reckon he's going to send a fast cooldown BFB at me. Whoa, we're 140... Whoa, we're 1400 eco. Wow, I didn't realise. So we might have to use a Boomer ability on this. I hope we can just get this up. Just get one more of those. Uh, should we get faster shred? We shall. And long range suck. The suck is very useful, definitely. But the best at suck, of course, is Master of. So it's this round. We've got the Glaive Lord, so which will sort out everything, basically. I think we're going to save up for a big rush. I think that's what he's doing as well. Oh, but we do have the Bloom Chippers, I guess. I'm going to use one of those abilities just to clear up all the balloons. Because there are a lot. How many pops have these got? Whoa, 6,000 and 3,000. That is a lot of pops. So we're going to send out some BFBs when we save up enough money. Hopefully, he won't be able to handle it. Um, I think he could, though. We'll see. We saved out almost 10,000. Actually, I think we're just going to save up for a defense. I just want to really defend his uh, rushes with the Boomer. It'd be so cool. He's getting up some more boomerangs. Interesting. Um, I think we'll be okay. We'll just use one of the abilities. Just use up one more of the abilities. Oh, wrong hotkey. Oh, by the way, guys, I do use the hotkeys. I do use them. So, I, I appreciate the comments on, like, use the hotkeys, use the hotkeys. This is what they are. But I do actually know how to use them, guys. I do actually know. Even if it doesn't seem like it sometimes. Right, so. We've got 2k eco. Which is very decent. Oh, is he going for the rush? Is he going for the rush? I think he's... Yeah, he's going for the rush. If, can we defend the oh my God with boomers? Now, I think it's not possible. I honestly think it's not possible. But, we're going to try it. I've, I, I've always wanted to try this. I, I can't deny it. I've always wanted to see... If these can defend, as oh my god. So we're just going to have to buy tons upon tons upon tons of these boomers. Right, okay. I'm pretty sure. Well, they're already doing damage. They're not meant to be doing damage already. Right, so we haven't got all the abilities back yet, which is a, a shame. Right, can we get that? Can we get it? Yes. Come on, monkeys, you can do it. Right, so. Can this defend? The oh my god. Come on, boomerangs. Come on. You can do it, come on. Oh my god, it's defending. No, they ran out. No, no. Oh, that was insane, though. They actually, they actually destroyed. <laughs> Good game, okay, right. That's it for this episode. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you found it entertaining. If you did, then leave a comment saying you did. And as always, see you in the next one.